Frisco Land is the first ever Dubai-based metaverse project in the Middle East, North Africa region built on Solana. And with me is a co-founder, Mohammed El Ayubi, to talk about Exco Land, the vision of the company. What's it all about? Welcome. Hi. So tell me about your vision for Exco Land. Right. So um, um, the vision of Exco Land is we want to be uh, like the f one of the leaders in this um in this uh you can call it like this industry now mm -hmm. the metaverse is now becoming an industry and big number of people are trying to be part of that so uh, we are the main vision of our uh, uh our uh, project is um to be one of the leaders and to do that we are actually um, providing users, or not like providing users, but the thing that we are uh, like the mission on how to be to to achieve this vision is to um, reach out to as many uh, possible uh, as many users as possible, enable them to enter the metaverse, providing them with the services and uh, giving them actually all the services or all the things needed for them to uh, be part of this metaverse. And of course, um, uh, our value proposition. I think this is like the most innovative value proposition that uh, anyone can think of that the metaverse is not actually about making money. It's more about or like paying so much and getting less. But our value proposition is the real feeling of the metaverse is to um, be part of it, like it is to be um, the sorry, the um, the value proposition of our metaverse is uh, the real feeling and the true living of a metaverse with more gaining than pain. So you pay less and you get more. So okay. that's actually the main uh, objective or like the main niche of our um, project that we are doing. Um, yeah. So walk me through um, Exco Land. Like, what can I do in there? What will I see? Do I need a headset to be able to right. access? Okay. So tell right. me about the experience. Uh, so uh, basically, Xgoland is so easy to be used and can be accessed from any device. So your mobile phone, Android, mm -hmm. iOS, you could desktop, and of course your VR. So VR gives you more like the realistic vision of uh, the metaverse. Uh, we are we are building it with the high quality uh, or like high graphics, so that users can see as as realistic as they can get uh, in a metaverse. Um, we are also like providing many features in there uh, regarding what you ask, like you want to see in the metaverse. So basically, uh, you have the feature or the ability to be the Jane King that is in real life as in the metaverse. So we have the duplicate avatar feature. So this duplicate avatar, you just upload your profile picture and then the engines will take all the facial details, hair color, eye color, all these stuff. And then your avatar will be generated with the high 3D and uh, graphics. So uh, th that's one of the main features that we have. Uh, the other thing, if you want to look more about the map, so we have three different sized lands. So you have the small land, you have the medium land, and you have the large land. And of course, uh, all land sizes depends on the user and his use case in this land and how he is willing to um, like build his stuff or business, a marketplace, a game, whatever you would like to be building in there. You can do whatever you like in the metaverse. Uh, you can build whatever you like. So it's more like opening the, the world somehow to be like instead of living in earth you live on the metaverse so yeah. it's the same thing the same concept but um it's more like getting people more close together uh of course uh, people using the duplicate avatar um feature uh, might for example take a, a famous celebrity let's say picture and then upload that as their avatar so to prevent that from hop from happening, so there is no more like one more than one Jane King in there. So uh, there there could be like five, six, seven different ones. But to know the the real one is using the very first unique feature in the metaverse, which is the verification feature. So the verification feature, we like we talk to you directly, let's say on Twitter, or you talk to us on Twitter. We tell you, okay, just post a tweet, let's say, or like fill a form that you are the real person and then the verification icon will be above the avatar. So when you walk in the metaverse, people will see, okay, that's the real one. That's not like a fake. You got, you got my point? Yeah, yeah. So that's also one of the main features in the metaverse and how you are going to be in there. 
That's interesting. I think you're the first company I've talked to that has verification in the metaverse. So yeah. <laughs> who is Exco Land for? Is this for fun or um, who would who would be yeah. your? Who, so who you? exactly the audience. Uh, the 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 audience that we are targeting. It's not like only fun or like only business or only that. No, it's more about everything so the the main idea when the metaverse came up and when people talked about the metaverse uh how people imagine like for example if you walk on the street and just ask someone what do you think about the metaverse they're gonna say vr play in game so that's basically the main idea they have so it's not like that we, what we are trying to offer people here is that for example if you're a business you have a a place that you can put your business in the metaverse. If you're a school, you can put your school or your education in the metaverse. Uh, if you are like an entrepreneur, you're a creator, you're an artist, you're first finding like or searching for something that uh, when you use uh, to be in the metaverse and then all the people see it and then you can engage with people and all these stuff. So basically it's it's more about everything. So it's not like one uh, one particular category. That's why you're going to see in our metaverse, you're going to see games, play to earn games. You're going to see uh, marketplaces, museums, art shows. You're going to see businesses, towers, buildings, uh, architects. So it's basically open for everyone. It's just mm -hmm. your imagination and your creativity that you can implement in this uh, metaverse. Yeah. And I, I mentioned earlier that it's built on Solana. So why Solana yeah. and how is that beneficial? Yeah, so Solana, basically all the people, like it's is getting a big hit now in the market, in the markets of a blockchain type. Uh, more people are saying it is the killer of Ethereum. Others are saying it's good for environment. So basically why we chose Solana is, uh, we all know Solana has a very fast transaction fee, uh, so transaction speed, sorry. So the transaction, it's more about like 40,000 transactions per second. So that's that's a good thing since you are a market, you are a metaverse. So you are going to have a big audience and you want to for them to have like fast transactions when they buy NFTs, when they sell things, when this and that. So you need fast transaction over there. And, and you mentioned the token. So tell me about that. Like how does someone yeah. acquire tokens? What can they use them for? And what is it called? Right. So, uh, it is called XGO token. Okay. So, yeah, the, actually, uh, to, to go to the name Exco again. So the main company name is Exco. Excoland is one of the projects that we are trying to be in the Web3 domain. So Exco is the main thing, then Exco Land, and then we're also going to have later on Exco Game, Exco NFT Marketplace. So there is many, many other projects as well. So uh, token, um, it's 1 billion tokens. Uh, thirty percent of that is going to be for crowd sale, so that's where the users gonna find on exchanges and all these stuff. Twenty percent of that is gonna be XGO token rewards, so that's when users are going to get rewards from our current, uh, like upcoming website that we're going to launch. So the website that we're coming to launch is uh, a minting website. So you're gonna mint your land. It's so if you mint your land, it's different than buying your land. When minting your land, you are the full owner of it. You can place royalties on there. You can change the name. You can uh, change the profile picture of the land. So you can put your your maybe your profile or your NFT or your uh, logo if you're a company. So you can put it on the map. So people also, when they just see the map, they see, okay, this is the guy over there. So that's also uh, one thing for minting. On that website, we are enabling the... Exco reward that is the air, that we call it's a kind of airdrop, but it's not like airdrop. So airdrop is just drops in your wallet directly. But what we are doing is, if you are a landowner in the metaverse, in our metaverse, uh, when we start this reward or this airdrop period for 24 months, you will be able to just connect your wallet. The system will read your wallet like what, how many lands you have. For example, you have two small lands one medium land, and then let's say one large land, for example. So each land has its own number of tokens that you are going to get monthly on a monthly basis. So uh, every month, for example, every beginning of month, so let's say we are in October, the 1 of November, you will open X Goland website, you connect your wallet, you're going to see the total, and then you're just going to claim it. So when you claim these rewards, these tokens, you can either sell it on 
exchanges or you just you can just have it in your wallet later on when we use the metaverse. Uh, so that's one thing on how the uh, Expo rewards are going to be collected. Yeah. And then finally, Mohammed, what's the roadmap? Uh, can I access Exco Land now? Yeah. Okay. So yeah. I, do I do that on my phone or through an app on the VR glass? Okay. How do I? So basically, uh, Exco Land, as if right now, in this moment, we have a coming soon website. So okay. this website has the white paper. It has mm. the video that contains maybe all the features that we tried to show in, in a video form. And it has the quality of the graphics. So it's somehow how you might see things in the XGoLand itself. So uh, the website is xgoland.io. It, ha it has the white paper. It has the video. It has a small description below the logo. Just like if you're a new user, you want to see this. Don't you just read the white paper, the whole thing. You just can read the small thing that has the same details that you already uh, said, which is first in the MENA region, the Solana blockchain, all these stuff. Okay, exciting. I'm going to check it out when uh, I'm sure. able to access it. So thank you sure. so much, uh, Mohammed, for coming and explaining Exco Land. Thank you so much for the experience. Luck. Yeah. We'll thank you. Thank you so much. It was like a real pleasure meeting you. Yeah. Thank you. <laughs> thank you. <laughs> 